love bugs how are you happy weekend you guys it's friday night and i hope that you guys are out having a great time being safe um this video is just going to be talking about the three day refresh and the 21 day fix and a little bit about team beachbody uh so if you're interested in the weight loss aspect of things on my channel please stay tuned um, I am trying really hard to figure out how to shorten my videos without taking out vital information that I really feel like you guys need to know. Um, but I, I'm not really sure what the happy medium is there. So you guys have a job in commenting and letting me know what you want to see, what you're interested in, and what is too long, what is not long enough, and just things like that. Please uh, help me grow my channel because I only want to make YouTube videos if it's impacting someone's life. I only want to make YouTube videos if um, someone out there can really relate to what I'm saying, what I'm doing, and what I'm putting out there. So for me to keep doing this, I really need some feedback. And um, yeah, let me go ahead and get into what this video is about. So Team Beachbody, where, where do I start with Team Beachbody? You guys, I was so, and you'll hear this a million times probably in these videos, I was very iffy about starting. And I've met two or three people in my life who um, worked as a coach for Team Beachbody that, um, that they didn't ever really push me to, to be signed up for Be Team Beachbody or anything, but... Um, you know, they really encourage you. It's part of their job as a coach. And I don't know, I just never really was ready to spend the money for my wellness until December. And um, so my coach is actually a wonderful person who I'm going to put her information in this video for you guys if you're interested in Team Beachbody tonight you may go check out her website and you guys can um, I could I should say today you guys can check out her information her website and if you're interested in uh, signing up for Team Beachbody definitely do it through her because she's just so so amazing um, anyways <laughs> I feel very tethered to her and I don't know if it's you know, I don't know why. It's not just about the whole fitness and workout thing. There's just, I feel very, like, connected to my coach. Her name is Vic Mary. And, um, she's just an amazing person. And what I really like about Team Beachbody so far is that the coaches are, are doing it with you. You know, it's not just, you know, them telling you what to do and, you know, look at me, look at me, I'm this coach, you know, and I'm going to coach you. They are literally on the journey also. And this is what I really, really love about uh, being part of Team Beachbody is just because there's so many amazing people that just want the same outcome for whatever reason. It may be for a different reason, but they all want the same outcome. So, um... That is the first thing I want to tell you guys about what I am doing. Um, the second thing is the three-day refresh. So when I signed up finally for Team Beachbody, I read about the three-day refresh and I thought, you know, that's a really great way to just kickstart my health journey. And what the three-day refresh is, is a three-day cleanse or detox, basically. And they just remove the meat, the dairy, the wheat, and just all the junk that you put into your body on a daily basis and the proteins you still have proteins you get it from the shakes and then you concentrate on just like fruits and vegetables and I did a little bit of research on the three-day refresh and uh, came to find that the general consensus from people was that they weren't able to finish for whatever reason and I'm not saying that to judge those people because we all react to things and um, you know handle things in different ways so um I'm this is not me judging them at all but I I did some research some of the people said that it made them feel weak um they just even though it's a three-day thing they just couldn't get used to not having the things that they were used to they felt hungry they felt dizzy they were having dark circles under their eyes things like that and 
I got kind of nervous because I thought, well, gosh, you know, like these people are saying these things and this is what's going to happen and I'm just not going to succeed. I'm going to be terrible. And um, what I found was that I totally dominated the three day refresh. And <clears throat> the way I saw it was, OK, it's for three days. It's going to kickstart um, my my whole process. And um, this is going to be a really great thing for me. And it's, I'm not sitting here telling you guys that I was perfect and that it was just easy peasy for me because it came with its difficulties, trust me. Um, the whole time I did it, all I wanted was pizza and Coke. I wanted a vanilla Coke so freaking bad and I wanted chicken wings and I wanted pizza and there was just all these things that I am so used to putting in my body that suddenly I was just like not giving myself and so my body was just like hey you know what the heck uh there was a couple times my husband went through arby's which i don't even really like arby's that much and he got a sandwich uh with corned beef on it and i am not even a corned beef fan whatsoever but i just remember him going through arby's and him buying this corned beef sandwich and me being like are you freaking kidding me <laughs> like I want this sandwich so bad. It smelled so good. But it was just because, you know, my mind was saying, hey, you know, whatever you're doing, we're not used to this. So I'm not sitting here telling you that the three-day refresh is just easy peasy and, oh, my God, these people couldn't do it. What the heck? It's me just basically saying um, that I did my research and they're, like I said, everyone um, handles things and reacts to things in different ways. For me, it gave me energy, and uh, I really feel like it was a great kickstart to what I'm trying to accomplish. Um, the only aspect of it that I really didn't care for, I tolerated it. It wasn't like the worst thing ever. I've had worse. But it was called a fiber sweep, and you did it in the morning between like your breakfast and your, your lunch. Um, it was like breakfast and then... Uh, snack and then you did your fiber sweep um and the fiber sweep is just a basically tasteless concoction that's really 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 thick and um it has chia seeds and stuff in it and I just I don't know I didn't hate it it was tolerable I just it's not it was probably my least favorite part of it and just being honest with you guys I believe I lost 7.8 pounds originally just from the three-day refresh I really feel like that's the number. I can't remember if it's between, if it's four or seven, but I really feel like it was 7.8 pounds. Um, if my coach watches this, she's welcome to correct me. Um, so that is my review on the three day refresh. I definitely give it five stars out of five stars. So um, I recommend it to people, but I want to recommend it to people who are you know, serious about their weight loss journey and uh, really feel like it's something that they will want to accomplish because like I said, it's it's not for everyone. Everyone handles and reacts to things in different ways. So, um, and for the people who couldn't finish it, you know, that doesn't mean that they won't ever finish it. You know, they could go back to it sometime in the spring, the summer, whatever, and they could totally dominate it. It's, so the next thing I'm going to talk to you guys about is the 21 day fix. And the 21 day fix is not just a 21 day fix which is what I thought it was because my question was um okay so what do I do after 21 days and for me that's a logical question but for other people they just kind of look at me like I'm an idiot but it's basically uh what they say is it takes 21 days to make or break a habit and so they call it the 21 day fix for that reason um, but it basically just focuses on portion planning and so with it came not just the Shakeology which I'll get into a little bit but it came with portion containers so that you can measure out your food for the day and so for my basic caloric needs I get five veggies I get three fruits five proteins a healthy fat and then I get one uh, one container of seeds or dressings and then I get five teaspoons of oils and nut butters 
Um, so best believe I've been loving my Evo oil and my almond butter. I love almond butter. So, um, if you love almond butter, can I get hay? Anyways, so that is the 21 day fix basically. Um, and Shakeology is another awesome thing. Shakeology, I was very wary of the Shakeology. It's basically a meal replacement or it's your protein that you need. Um, and I got it confused with a, another shake that's out there. And I was like, I don't know if I'm going to want to do the Shakeology because uh, I thought it had like fake sugar, you know, like sugar substitutions in it and I can't have those. So I was like petrified of the Shakeology. Kind of find out it didn't have any of that nonsense so it's all good guys Shakeology is my life I don't feel like I ever want to give it up so um I've decided that my favorite flavor is chocolate so I like my chocolate Shakeology and the 21 day fix has been really awesome yeah I did really great for the first two weeks and then this past week I have not done so well um I I'm an emotional eater, so I've been eating all of my feelings this week, and um, so just because I want to be real with you guys, I'm going to go ahead and tell you everything. Um, I had lost about almost 12 pounds total doing this whole thing, from the 3-day refresh to through the 21-day fix, um, which it surpasses what I usually lose when I change my diet habits and you know I'm, I'm exercising and everything so I had lost almost 12 pounds and um the last time I checked it was like nine inches altogether um and I've gained about two pounds back this week just because I have eaten horribly um but even though I'm super hard on myself, I am very hard on myself. And this is something that my coach has been like really, really trying to help me uh, through <laughs> is that I have to stop beating myself up. I have to stop being hard on myself. And so that's like, that's my message to you guys too, is to just not ever give up and not to be so hard on yourself. Um, because even if you are having a bad week um, and you can progress in even the littlest ways that's still progress you know and the progress that I've made is that I realize okay I've, I've just had a stressful week and I'm eating all my feelings and um so this is what I need to do and even through realizing these things I have been able to control myself a little more than I usually would so in the past when I got off track that would just be it I would just get off track and be like well screw it I'm done you know and not to say that I didn't try that <laughs> I did uh have a moment where I was like screw it I give up you know and between my wonderful amazing coach and my husband uh I wasn't allowed to give up so it's just inspiration for you guys uh, that I want you guys to take and to listen to. Um, and that's basically my video. If there's any questions you guys have, anything you guys want to know, please leave me a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. I would love to have more friends and family. Um, I basically consider you guys my family. And I would love it if you would give this video a thumbs up. And for more videos... To be notified of more videos, you can hit that little bell next to the subscribe button so that you can know what I'm up to if you're interested. That'd be great. So here's to wishing you guys infinite love and lots of hugs. And I hope that you guys have a great weekend. Bye.